Hello everyone and welcome back, my name is Mate and today we are continuing the Lannister campaign. Uh, you may remember we recently started playing as Tyrion and have the Stormlands and Westlands under our control. Uh, there is a war against the Iron Islands for Tommen to uh, gain it. He's also our heir at the moment. Uh, eventually we would like to move the capital from Storm's End to the Rock just because I've invested quite a bit into the Rock although having said that well we'll see what happens but we certainly want to keep both the Storm's End and the Rock under personal control uh, yes of course I would travel to the wedding so we're currently preparing a feast, but we don't want to spend too much money because we don't have much. It seems that Sumner, the spy master of all Lord Edric of Sarsfield, um, well, there's a 39 percent chance of him dying or no effect because of my high intrigue skill, and he's trying to rescue Lord Paramount Mace from King Balon's captivity. Well, I'd rather it not be revealed. I'm sh it's a bit annoying that there's not an option not to do that. However, I might give... Where's Cersei at the moment? She's married to Lancel. And Lancel owns the Trident. And Tymond owns the Riverlands as a whole. Oh, here we go. We've heard from the Night's Watch that the White Walkers from the Beyond the Wall have been defeated. Dennis Manister was the leader of this war. Wow, well done. The world is not completely safe yet. Well, the White Walkers have done well. Or, oh, sorry, have done poorly. Is there a king beyond the wall? Not yet. All the guests have arrived. Looks like Balon will be taken down fairly quickly. So troops-wise, we've got 13,000 personal levy and 13,000 vassal levy, and most vassals like me. A minority property owner of Storm's End has come to our court seeking justice. He accuses my courtier Jane Darry of arson. Uh, I can arrest her. Make her pay recompense. Uh... Or, I think we'll make her pay recompense. As the feast begins, Lord Harlan Wagstaff presented a petition before the court. He says that crime and banditry is an increasing threat. So I can send Sir Gregor to solve the problem. Or suggest that he deals with it himself. Well, I'm not spending that gold, so he can deal with it himself. So guests weren't very satisfied with the food, but I'm afraid we haven't got the funds. Income is slow. Ah, uh, here we go. Tywin's funeral. As the Silent Sisters finish the preparations of the deceased, the body of Lord Paramount Tywin is brought to the local sept and laid atop the altar at its centre. Canopic jars of ornate design are placed at the feet of the dead, and the eldest child places the death stones upon the closed eyes of the deceased. One by one, those closest to the departed in life make their way into the sept. I mean, we wouldn't have really have done this for him if we were following the story canonically, but seeing as we played him, it felt like a good thing to do. Songs are written of him. So at the moment the Reach is held by Mace. But Mace is still in prison. You're at war. Okay. I can give you an artifact, but I don't want to do that. 
the bedding of Sir Davin remains. Okay, so my cellar is air. So either way, a Lannister will rule, so I'm happy about that. I would, however, like to get some claims going. Tumbleton would be a good addition. Or Red Lake. Yeah, Red Lake's better. Or even Old Oak. What brings more money? 43 and 62. Old Oak is not as good. Red Lake it is. Let's get that claim going. Oversee the realm. And surely we have a better spy master than that. Yeah. And my wife is Lady Paramount. Oh, she has she has no claim on. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, well, can't be helped. She likes me. We have no kids, though. We do need to get some kids going. So I seem to want to be improving my martial ability, which I don't really want to do. So I'll cancel that as soon as I can next year. I have a claim for the High Lordship of the Trident, but to claim that I need to declare war on my nephew, which I'm not going to do. Oops, there's a defeat there. Rob, currently uh, not looking so hot. He is married to Lady Daisy of the North. I suppose that gives her some rights. John Stark is the heir. So Rob, what about where's Jon Snow? He's heir to the Night's Watch. Okay. So who has ice in all this? Does... Didn't we give ice to Joffrey? So presumably you should have ice. Yeah, because we made it Widow's Whale, that's it. Oh wow, we got the claim already. My work in Red Lake seemed to have come to fruition by bribing, cajoling, extorting. Excellent. It's going to cost me a lot of gold though. But, worth doing. Uh, and do I just... Okay, so I can't declare it whilst we're at war. Adam Marbrand offers to teach me a game called Cyvas. Uh, yeah, sure. I kind of do need the money now, Tommen. Sorry to be a pain. Uh, Adam wants to challenge you to a game. Unfortunately, me and my council decided the Iron Throne simply cannot afford to pay your coin at this time, but rest assured you receive what is owed in due course. I need the money. What a good game. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, as we've got that claim, let's improve relations when we can. External enemy. Should we fulfill... So... You are facing war from external enemies. Who are these external enemies? I mean, yeah, I'll help you. Are these my troops? Did I summon these troops? Oh god, I've really forgotten what I was doing. Well, let's go save Tommen. And let's get some decent commanders in. Good God. Brienne of Tarth. Philip. Go, go, go. I mean, I haven't actually summoned my troops, though, have I? Oh, I have summoned some. Huh. I don't remember doing that, but I must have. No, no, no. Stay with me. And why have I got mercenaries? Where, where, where is everyone going? King's Landing, King's Landing. Okay, good. 
So everyone needs to go to King's Landing. And then we need to kick out Balon. Uh, I have some prisoners. Yes, we'll ransom you. I need the gold, please. Melisandre wants to kill me. Please don't do that. And she is Master of Whisperers of the Iron Throne, but I'm not surprised because she has got excessive intrigue. Looks like the war against Balon has gone fairly well. The Lannisters have helped out good old King Tommen. Yeah, 60%. Let's follow up and attack this army. We're also over the vassal limit, which is a bit of a problem. Uh, he's sieging out Pike. So if he's going to do that, I'm not going to mess about sending troops over to the Iron Islands. Uh, yeah, why are all these places getting threats? Well, they didn't take any... No, I mean, we could just disband our troops, really. Patrol posts in Castle Rock has been built, that's good. That gives them a nice boost. Let's improve... Yeah, perform statecraft. That's good. Serve the court. Perform charity. I don't really need Castamere anymore, so... If Uncle Kevin is... Oh, Uncle Kevin died. Uh, what about you, Martin? You're of Black Crown. So we don't want to give you anything. Anyone in the court of interest? A bunch of frays. Muriel Lannister. Sansa Stark is my wife, isn't she? No, she's not. She's married to Lucian. And she has a claim for the North. So I could press her claim. Uh, I don't want to claim the trident from you. King Tommen's got fat. Nothing really of interest there. I could claim the north though. Uh, the war is now at 74%. I think it's just a question of him sieging out Pike now. So I am going to disband my troops. Oh, he's sending some troops there, just as I say that. Uh, who's trying to do what? Just don't do anything bad. Okay, you won't listen to me. Yes. Fabricate a claim on the Kingdom of Westlands? Uh, no thank you. Tymond, know your place. Anyone else? He wants to incite revolt. Ugh, let's not do that. Thanks. I don't really want to hold on to Castamere. Becoming a bit of a burden. So, who's in the court? That is. Uh, there's a Lannister, my uncle. Let's give it to him. Yeah. Lordship of Castamir, include the lower titles. Uh, you can just have the High Lordship, to be honest. I don't particularly want it, and I need to get my 
fossil limit down. So yeah, all yours. There you go, brother. Or uncle, brother. And that means he loves me. My lord, I'm deeply hesitant to ask, but the coffers of your loyal subjects are running dry. No, pla placate him with flattery. Spring the troops back. Uh, I still can't declare war on you for Red Lake, but I will have it, believe you me. Do you have any packs with anyone great? Wow, you're a good marshal. So what other land are we holding? Just Casterly Rock and Storm's End now. Okay, that's good. So let's disband the troops. Make everyone happy. Uh, what's going on with you? So they're fighting for Midlaw points, which would kick out my nephew. Who's winning? No one at the moment, but if Robert of the Vale gets a bit too cocky, I think we'll put him back in his place. How many troops do you have? You have less. You don't even want an alliance with me, and you don't want a non-aggression pact. You know what? I could just take the trident from you, quite frankly. But I won't. And the plots, please. So many plots. God. Okay, okay, okay. So that war's now at 100%. Hopefully that will end it. Yep. Good. So that's the war over. So can I declare war on you? Or do I have to declare war on Mace? Have to declare war on Mace. Okay. Where's Withers? A husband and wife musician couple has arrived from Lis. Their performances range from vulgar satires to political servants. Uh, because I have the gregarious trait, yeah, let's do that. Well, Mace currently has 15, 18,000 troops. So now we're all in one kingdom, can I... I cannot. Do I still have to declare war on him? Yeah. That's a bit annoying. I mean, we could do it whilst we have the troops and he's in prison. But it'll be a bit of, bit of a costly war for us. We could just claim the trident from my nephew. Hmm. Because if we do, then we have three of the seven kingdoms. I mean, my vassal limit will be way over, but. Yeah. Oh, I've decided to bestow upon me Warden of the West. That's very kind. Thank you, Tommen. Do you like me, or...? No, you're not that fussed by me. Zena. Zena now rides a dragon. Okay, what's her dragon? I mean, she's a bit of a no one. How's she suddenly got a dragon? 
Carl Jomo the Quiet. Pentos looks big. Has Pentos been going to war? Pentos looks quite thick. Limited realm authority. Yes, please. Thank you. I don't really want to have to fight you, but I may. How is the war going for the Trident? It's not really. I think what we'll do then is let me know in the comments what you reckon we should do if we should go for a claim on the Trident and then we'll control three of the seven kingdoms uh, and I will do that for next episode so do let me know in the comments in the meantime please do like comment and subscribe and I will see you all in the next one